I'm, I'm starting off this video a little differently. I, this isn't a controversy. I think I'm hoping everybody at least has at least somewhat of the same opinion on me with me on this. Okay. I'm mad. I'm extremely mad. Okay. This is, this is making me mad. So Link's Awakening is one of my favorite Zelda games because I got to experience it in HD when I owned a Switch. It is one of my favorite games of the entire Zelda series. One of. I have multiple Zelda games and, that I like. And the issue with this is Nintendo is very strict with their property. And I can understand, you know, like if I was the leader of a multi-billion dollar company, I feel like things would be a lot different because... I would let the fans decide what they can do with my property because, hey, you can have as much fun. If you're not making any money off of this, if I'm not making money off of this, we're both okay. You know what I'm saying? As long as you're not also making millions of dollars, I mean, that's totally okay. You know what I'm saying? That would be fine. That would be fair. That would be nice. Here's a problem, okay? So there was a HD version of Link's Awakening created. They, they it used the Game Boy assets and everything like that. It was just awesome. The Switch version was extremely great, okay? I love that game to death. It's one of my favorite games, okay? Anyways, over here, I'm going to show you. It's great. It looks just really, really good. The, 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 these people, this is not my video, by the way. Obviously, this is uh, OTG Gaming. They actually make some pretty good content. Go subscribe. I really recommend them. Uh, anyways, I, I just thought I'd show you this. It, it, it looks great. He shows off all the settings this can do. This, everything was just made so greatly. This looks amazing. And again, so yeah, it went from that to this. It looks so good. Man, and Nintendo won't take the time out to do this. I mean, yes, we all want 3D recreations of these games. Okay, we all do. But one of my biggest concerns right now, actually, is getting a recreation of Super Mario World just like this. I've always wanted it. I don't want to be playing it on an emulator. I want to launch it from an EXE file and play it from a brand new engine with better physics and all that good stuff. The physics in Super Mario World, that engine is amazing. But if someone could just modernize it just a little bit and just recreate it just like this, I would be happy, man. But guess what? Nintendo won't let you. They won't let you have any fun at all. They will not let you have any fun with nothing. You cannot have fun. That is their policy. They don't care about us, the gamer. They care about money. That is their biggest concern, and that's totally fine. You know, it's their property. They can do whatever they want with it. But again, at the same time, let the fans have some fun, but guess what? They won't do it. I'm getting emotional pretty much over nothing, but this game right here, it, it just, it looks great, okay? Look, they, they have... This can go up to, I, I think I seen it was like 120 FPS consistently, no issues. And you can even mess with the scale right here, it looks like. And you can, it looks so good. And YouTube compression's not doing it any, any justice because I guess it, it would look so nice and crispy. Look at this, it looks so good, so dang good. I would actually pay money for them to create a PC port of this game, but they won't do it. They just won't. Either they're too afraid or obviously it's their property. They want only stuff on their consoles. Okay. This looks amazing. Just so fantastic. The developers behind this, I guess, were never actually known. So, I mean, to be fair, they it, I don't blame them for hiding their identity. But it's just the fact that I can't enjoy something like this from a fan that made it completely for free. You know what I'm saying? They're not making any money off this game except for the new recreation. But even that, I barely see it being sold anywhere. And guess what? It's locked behind a $60 paywall. A $60 paywall. Okay? That game is not worth $60. I would, I would be glad to say $30. It's a recreation of a... 30 something year old game now, maybe 25, maybe, I don't know. I'm just saying, look at this, it looks amazing. And guess what they had to go and do? Tear it down. They are just very stingy with their property, okay? Here's the takedown notice I seen literally as soon as it got published, I'm fairly assuming, because this video is like a month old, okay? This was done on, it didn't say the day. So here it is, I'm gonna look, at, I'm gonna read it to you. To whom it may concern, I am an authorized representative of Nintendo of America Inc., owner of the following copyrighted material. It has come to our attention that the following game offered on itch.io infringes and makes unauthorized use of Nintendo's copyrights 
in the links in the Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening video game. For additional information, visit Nintendo's website at the following URLs, and then you can go and look at their stuff. Ah, what did I tell you? It leaves a link to a $60 remaster of Link's Awakening. When actually, you know what, in my opinion, I have a good feeling this probably played 400 times better than what this plays at. Don't get me wrong, okay? I loved this game. $60, the other one free, and it wasn't making any money, okay? They weren't making any money. It was a tribute of love and passion for these games. And you know how they treat people who want to show their love for Nintendo? They go and strike it down. That is the biggest thing with this company that I just hate. I love their games. I hate the business practices. They suck, okay? The CEOs at Nintendo suck. I would have loved to play this so badly, so badly. This looks just so good. I love the way this looks. This look, I prefer this style more than the 3D models. I don't care if it's in 3D. I wish they would make remat, like the Pokemon Generation 5 games. I don't want a 3D remaster. I want a full widescreen HD 16 by 9 remaster, crispy, perfect looking pixels. The, the, the community behind this is just so goddamn good. Okay, it's amazing. And they went and tarnished. I just now found out about this. This is a month old. This just now hit my recommended. And I'm sad because I really would have loved to play this. I really would have. I would have loved to enjoy, ha have to enjoy this. I feel like this would have been better than what Nintendo offers for $60. The settings this has, the settings this thing offers, you can have, look at this. They went, it went from this to this. This is all, what I've always wanted. And they went and tarnished. God, I hate Nintendo. I am so pissed. Royally, <laughs> royally pissed. I'm pissed. Royally pissed. I got that out of my way. You know, I got that out of the way. That's how I feel. Please just have a wonderful day, please. And keep your eyes out for ports like this. <laughs> Have a good one.